Hey, hello everyone. Uh, today let's see how video editor, uh, which is available in Windows 10, uh, which is a freeware again. Let's just go through what it does have have an offering and see how this can help uh, the people who's just started video editing. Uh, does this tool help? Let's just dive into and see whether this uh, particular tool helps or not. So first thing first, let's see uh, what we have. This is the primary main screen uh, that just opens up moment you start the video editor tool. And let's work on a project. Let's say click on new video project. All right, so this is the stuff which comes out. Okay, first thing, uh, first we need to name the project that we have to work on. You can name anything. It can be nature videos. Okay. okay so we have named our project and given a point of time if you would like to change it you can just come over here and click on the pencil symbol to change it um, so moving forward let's import a video uh, by getting into project library click on add so we have options to import from this PC from my collection from the web for now I would choose from this PC and I would pick um, any of one of one or a couple of sample videos uh, let me just uh, okay put this into my library yes uh, we have the video uh, in the library let me just drag and drop in the storyboard all right uh, it's just simple all you have to do is just drag and drop uh, to the storyboard it just comes and sits in here likewise you can add multiple videos let's do it again from this pc then let's choose another video all right let me do the same thing drag and drop yes all right so now we have the storyboard which is a um, thing we can call it the timeline uh, where we have set of videos that we have imported just shows up in here let's also see what all the other features that we uh, can read through in the storyboard area uh we have add title card let me just click on it oh, okay uh so it is the title card which just comes up in here so you can drag and drop around uh wherever you want to put in and fit in for now let me put this in the beginning and let me just check uh, if i would be able to add some text okay click on add text let me say first Windows video editor and say okay. All right, so we have a title card, but again, going back to this, I have also uh, want to touch base. We have animated textile, uh, you can feel free to play around uh, the fonts and the other templates that is already pre built in this tool and you also have the layout section you can uh, keep these text or play around with these text wherever you'd like to appear on the screen or on this card and further you also have a background so you can click on background and choose your uh, any colors that you would like to have or you can also click on add new custom color you can play around this color gamut to see uh, pick and choose whichever is apt for your uh, video project all right let me jump back uh, to the main board okay so we have the title card we have the video and stuff let me just click on the video for now and see what what uh, this video editor has an offering so we have done with that title card what else we have uh, it's the trim so if you like to trim the video you can just play around with the slicer uh, where you'd like to place it and if you say done the clip length would be uh, cropped as uh, accordingly for now I would not do anything just click on ok and so we also have split so clip 1 we have clip 2 then let me just uh, if I put the pointer in here if I say done uh, so now if you see we have the clip split 
and this is how you're gonna uh, split the clip or split the video file so further moving on we can add uh, the text over here as well so nature looks serene uh, again you can feel free to play around with the text and it, it applies for the same uh, video clip where you are or if you can also play around with the duration for how long this particular text has to appear so you can play around with this and say my text should appear for only uh, one minute yes it, it it's gonna appear only for one minute and you click on done and finally we have uh, is the motion effects so you can uh, set the motion effects so if you click here let me just play and see how it comes up you see these text can uh, you know, fly around or zoom in or zoom out so which are the motion how the motion you would like to have or add it on the te text it can uh, do the same and I will click on cancel okay and i would not uh, use the 3d effects since it takes time to load but still you can uh, play around with it click on see what features you have but moving on with filters uh, we have various filters so if you see my scene over here i would just click on adventure so it makes and adds that filter on top of my original video file likewise you have pearl so you have various uh, filters at the moment you can play around with this and see um how you can um play your scene well if your scene requires these kind of effects yes you can come here and add the effect if that's required and what else do we have uh, is the speed uh, so you can basically set the speed of the clip do you want to uh, play the clip slow normal or fast so you can play around with it and see how uh, how the video can how the video is spaced up so if you want certain part of clip to be fast and uh, moving uh, very quickly so that it will not consume more time then you can split that clip and apply the uh, clip speed on that particular clip so it helps you to you know make that scene uh, move faster and um, yes so these are self-explanatory buttons we have remove uh, rotate and the delete button so finally uh, okay sorry before you go on to finish video let's see if we can able to upload a background music so you click on background music and so there are predefined music in this so if if you would like to use the same music you can or else I think we have an option called custom audio uh, where you click and choose your own audio add the audio file so you can choose your audio and if you just play it let's just see what happens so yes so custom audio is added um, alright so this is uh, the final part so we have uh, add the title card we have split the clip we have added some text to it we have added uh, some effects to it finally if, if you're uh, good enough and confident that this video can is the final uh, cut I have or you won't want to export it yes you all you have to do is come to finish video choose the video quality do you want to export it to 1080p recommended or the medium is 720p or the low resolution 540 so you'd say high resolution export it and it would ask you uh, where you, where would you like to store this and yes finally uh, this particular video set would be rendered and you would be you'd be uh, able to use that final clip yes I hope um, this video was helpful uh, this just gives a first level walkthrough I think you can play around and explore more in it I hope this was helpful if you really felt this was helpful please subscribe to the channel like share and subscribe thank you very much bye